Abner. I'm standing on Highway 84 right now, and I just spoke to the driver of this semi truck behind me. He says a pickup was traveling eastbound on this road. He started going off into the ditch. He overcorrected. He went over four lanes of traffic and hit the semi way back there. The driver of the semi says he wasn't able to stop. He finally got to this point, and now the pickup truck is resting behind the semi. Now, we're not sure how many people were in the pickup truck. The semi driver is okay. He just says he's shaken up. With two fires on the same street, residents are nervous and ready for this apartment complex to be torn down. Now, the National Weather Service in Lubbock has issued a wind advisory as well as a blowing dust advisory, which will both be in effect until 7 p.m. this evening. For Natalie's neighbors say they saw the man running down this staircase with Natalie's children and heading for the alley. In King County, standing where a fire was just two days ago. It's now behind me, and as firefighters try to contain the blaze, the Salvation Army of Lubbock is out here every single day providing emergency disaster services.